and let's be good farmer. You've just started. Ah, uh, with me, this is my planting bag. So I'm rolling my copies uh, into the planting bag. The one who has been training them on how to do these things. So there is no way you're going to train people how to do things that you don't know. You need to do all that is in your power to make sure that you get money or to make sure that you earn, uh, no matter how rich it is uh, in your farm. Many of the time that we focus on the crops that gives us uh, big margins of profit, and we forget that there are other crops that we can do, though the margin is not as big, but at the end of it, with consistency, you realize a very good margin at the end of the season or at the end of the year. Uh, I've seen farmers investing millions and millions in um, in these crops, in tomatoes, in onions, and they end up losing everything. Yet, if you do other crops, you make good money uh, out of them. And uh, though it's not as big margin as the others, and... and uh, at the end of it, you win. If you can be consistent throughout the year, you make sure you you are selling them uh, throughout the year. Uh, I I can assure you that you are going to get something good. Uh, we are starting our journey, as you can see. Uh, with me here is cowpeas. We are starting our journey uh, to starting growing cowpeas in this model farm uh, for commercial use and also for for trainings. Uh, because I'll be taking you through the training on how to grow them on different stages. And the good thing about cowpeas is it takes the shortest time period. Uh, cowpeas, like other, uh, other um, vegetables, takes 21 to 28 days to maturity. 21 days, you are in the market. 20 days, you are in the market. You can sell it uh, as, a, as vegetables, as green leaves. You can also sell it as... Uh, as a vegetables, as uh, grains, like the ones that are molding, it can be consumed as grains, it can be consumed as green leaves. So, what are you waiting for? Are you ready to join me in this journey of 21 to 20 days to see how much you can make in this, or to see the millions you can make in this? Because I am assuring you, we are making good money out of this. We have certain, this is a portion of land that have demarcated that we will be planting for today, I'll be doing them on weekly basis uh, uh, for the next like uh, 55 weeks because I've started next week, I'm, I'm, I'm doing another one and the whole of 2024, I'll be doing them in weekly basis. That's why I've said it's, it's, 50, it's 55 weeks, not 56 weeks. 55, for the next 55 weeks, I'll be doing copies. Uh, because I've, I've done the cost analysis, I've seen I can be able to pay so many bills using this one. Farm bills and other buying other inputs uh, as I focus on, on, on other crops. So, work with me, learn, practice, and let's be good farmer. You've just started. After getting your seeds ready, now this is our land. We want to subdivide it into portions, just like the way you have been sub subdividing the beds uh, for doing the nursery. But this time round, uh, because of our system of irrigation, it's allowing us uh, even to do on a flat bed, but at least it's a demarcated uh, section. So uh, this is how I'm doing it. And uh, my beds, or the area that I'm I'm doing is uh, I'm, I'm doing in a uh, in bed of about two meters from one bed to the other.
that how I subdivide my my land uh, to make sure it's in equal portions also for easy irrigation so th those are that this is the section that I'll be sowing my seeds today and um, I'm able also to know uh, when I'm calculating my capacity of production on or when I'm calculating calculating what I'm getting from the land I'll be able now to take uh, the production from each section and be able to know uh, the much the land is giving me without much concentrating on the on the entire entire farm though there is a general cost cost of production but with one unit here I'll be able to be able to give a good calculation one thing one thing about this crop is uh, it's it's pure organic crop I just need to sow it today and irrigate it no chemical no fertilizer just the seeds and irrigation pure organic crop so and uh, as you can see everything is done we plowed so it's uh, with me this is my planting bag i know uh, you may be wondering what i'm using here we, we are making it as simple as possible this is my planting bag so i'm rolling my copies uh into the planting bag and it's full these cowpeas can be consumed as grains and can be, be consumed as uh, as veggies so these are the grains of cowpeas as these are the grains very beautiful very good yeah it's a very good uh, so this bag i want to show you how how, how we, we do it in most cases this it's done by ladies or by women they, they are the one who do this but uh, for the sake of training eh, i'm going to 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 show it to you because I'm, I'm also their teacher so this is my rope it's a ba it's a it's a banana rope a fibrous banana loop that's what i'm i'm tying with uh -huh, i put it here and tie my bag so my bag is ready it's ready for planting so it's placing my idea and start planting this is my planting tool a panga and uh, the bed that i want to start planting is this one uh, when planting these seeds one the secret or the formula is don't step on where you've sowed the seeds when sowing the seeds so you have to sow them as you go backward so that's how i plant them uh remember what i told you these veg veggies we are going to we are going to um to uproot them so after after 21 to 28 days we start uprooting them so we are we are we are, we are planting them in uh, it's more of a broadcasting because there is no formula in this more of a broadcasting manner as simple as that So what it's there is nothing add here. Yeah. Like, like I told you, I'm I'm the teacher. I'm, I'm I'm the teacher. So that's why don't ask me who taught me this. I'm a farmer, I'm the teacher. So I need to show you practically. Because also my farm workers, my farm manager, I'm the one who has been training them on how to do these things. So there is no way you're going to train people how to do things that you don't know. So a teacher must know for them to train. So this is how I plant my my seeds. It's more of a broadcasting, but this time round we are burying them. Simple as that.
and the whole of the, the section that have subdivided must be done in few hours. You see how simple it is, just eating the panga, dropping and burying them, making sure all the seeds are covered. Eh? I don't know how you do them in your place. Also, you can do them by using lines. You don't need to do them the way I'm doing it because uh, uh, it's, it's my irrigation system. It's my irrigation system that is giving me the permission to plant them the way I'm doing them. Some do them on Brisbane, some do the trenches and do them, but mine are scattered because I'm using the override irrigation and that way I'm getting the freedom. So it's it's that we are doing it that way till we are done. It's dropping and burying, dropping and burying, dropping and burying. You drop the seed, you bury the seed. So, like I told you, you you can't you can't sow the seeds and uh, and step on them at the same time. So this is how we do it. quick as that you drop your body you drop your body Ooh. What have you learned? The farmer, the newbies who want to get into farming, those who are into farming. You see, these are the things that I've been telling you about. There is no way you leave your people to do you the work that you've never done. You need to know these things, even if you are not. You want to be doing them. Always you want to be doing them daily, but you need to do to do to do them. So that when you're told we did this section the whole day, at least in your mind you know it's possible to do this section the whole day. It's not possible to do this this section the whole day. So you need to learn it. It's our first day of sewing. The first day of sewing our copies. Um less than that in less than 30 days, we'll be in the market. But before we go to the market, I'll be taking you through the processes uh, from when they germinate up to the management, but the management is just irrigation. I'll update you on a weekly basis so that you can learn and know this crop that you can make good money with, without much struggle, with the less capital. Because you, you all say that you need capital to start farming. Watch this and see there, there are some farm uh products or some 
uh, there are some vegetables in the farm that doesn't need much capital and have good money. If it's your first time you're watching us, don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel so that we can continue learning together. Bye.